video, I'm going to be giving you guys a run through of my lazy day hair routine. What I do when I don't really want to do my natural hair. And my hair's been in this bun for about three days now and my edges are all crusty. And it's just a nice, simple way to do your hair when you aren't really feeling your natural hair. And you can do it all in the shower. You don't really need a mirror or anything. It's just super quick, super simple. The only thing you have to do outside of the shower is lay your edges, which is not bad at all. But this style lasts me a whole week and it is also a protective style so that you can protect your hair when you don't want to do it. So like I said, this is three day old hair so I'm just going to take you guys in the shower with me and we're going to do this lazy hair routine. But before we hop into this video, if you are new to my channel, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now. And don't forget to hit that bell button as well because I'm going to be posting often. Also, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Guys, so I'm starting off in the shower and I'm just taking my hair out of the bun and then I'm just going to completely drench my hair under the water while also finger detangling. As a result of finger detangling, I had a very tiny amount of hair loss, but I think because I trimmed my hair so recently that I don't have as much breakage. But now I'm just going to go in with the Aussie Moist Smooth Conditioner. This is the only conditioner that I had in the shower. It's not made for curly hair, but it still makes my hair very smooth and easy to detangle. let my hair run under the water to get all the conditioner out while also continuing to finger detangle and I'm going to go ahead and make my part that I'm going to be using for my style which is going to be the double cornrows. Just a little bit. And then once I finish getting the part how I want it going all the way back, I'm then going to take the largest side of my head and work on that side and clip the other side. So now I'm going to be getting into the products that I'm using on my hair. be using is the Texture ID Day and Night Moisturizing Treatment. This is a very moisturizing oil or balm I should say because you can put it on your skin as well. It works very nice for protective styles and it keeps your hair moisturized for a very long time. The next product that I'm going to be going in with is the Jamaican Black Castor Oil in the scent Peppermint. This is very essential for promoting hair growth. I think black castor oil in general. But I usually just put this all over my hair and then massage it into my scalp. Next is the Texture ID Styling Cream. This is another very moisturizing product by them. All of their products are just out of this world great. But I specifically love these two that I use in this video because I use them for most of my protective styles. So I'm just working this through my hair and making sure that I use a good amount. I had to go back maybe three or four times to make sure that I had a good amount of product in my hair because when you are doing your hair to last for a long period of time, you want to make sure that it is moisturized. The next hair product that I use is the 97.7% Pure Aloe Vera Gel by the Up and Up brand from Target. I use a good amount of this on my hair. It provides a good hold and it also defines my curls while keeping my hair moisturized at the same time. I honestly haven't seen many people using this product as a hair product. It's supposed to be used for your skin, but it has done wonders for me and my hair, so 
if you want to give it a try, I can vouch for the fact that it is a good product for your hair. So now I'm just going to continue to rake the product through my hair, making sure that everything's covered, and then I'm going to begin the braiding. tutorial on my channel just let me know in the comment section down below so now I'm just going to repeat the same thing to the other side that I'll be using is the Edge Booster by Style Factor and I'm also going to be using my Edge Control Brush and I'm just laying my edges here. I'm then going to go in with my microfiber towel and just wrap it around my hair while I get dressed so that it can soak up some of the water. I am done getting dressed for the day or just like my lounge around outfit and then I'm just going to take the towel off my head making sure that I pull straight up so I don't mess up my edges and I'm just gonna recurl these little curls on the side. This is the completed look for my hair. I'm gonna do one more 360 to give you guys the finished look and the finished result from how it looks when the towel comes off. And as you saw in the shower, I used my product, I used my oils, and I did use a gel. That is all that I have for you guys for today's video. If you like this video, please go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and click the bell button as well to be notified whenever I post a new video because I will be posting more consistently. And also, don't forget to leave any video suggestions down below in the comment section. And that is all that I have for you guys today. Bye!